Hey everybody, Davey here from Davey's World Fishing. Today I'm down here in Long Beach, California. I'm fishing right next to the iconic Queen Mary. And we're gonna chase a couple sand bass, maybe some spotted bay bass, halibut, and you never know, calico bass might pop up as well. Stay tuned. <laughs> Now the spot that I'm at right here, I'm in about uh, 24 feet of water. I'm gonna fish that A-rig. Just gonna make nice long casts. I'm almost parallel to that break wall there right now in front of the Queen Mary. I'm gonna let that A-rig sink all the way down to the bottom. And then I'm gonna try to keep it down as low to the bottom as possible on my retrieve. Uh, these fish, these sand bass right now, they're all hunkered down right along the sand, uh, right along a little bit of rocks down there. There's a little bit of some kelp, even some eelgrass that you're going to pull up. But those sand bass like to stay low. So what I'll do is I'll do a nice, slow, steady retrieve. I'll let the bait pause, and once I get a little bit of slack in my line, I know it hit back at the bottom again. I'll take a few more cranks. I'm going to let that bait pause, get it back down to the bottom, and then I'm going to reel it in again. So you're going to keep doing that over and over. I'm going to kind of fan cast the area, then I'll move up a bit. I'll fan cast the area and move up a bit and kind of keep doing the same thing over and over. These fish along these break walls can be absolutely anywhere, but when you find them, you're usually going to find quite a few of them. Very simple technique on that A-rig, as you can see it, the A-rig in salt water, you can actually fish all five baits. So I'm going to make nice long casts. Let that bait sink out to the bottom, and then I'm gonna bring it right along the bottom. Another thing you wanna do if you wanna stay with the straight retrieve is you just wanna keep bringing it back. So when that bait comes up, it's gonna like sink in like an octopus, and then when you slow down, it's gonna spread back out. Those bars are fairly tense, they're gonna spread back out. You reel in, it's gonna come in. It's gonna almost do like a squid or an octopus swimming. So that bait hit the bottom there. Right there, it's probably about 25, 26 feet. Give it that nice, slow, steady retrieve for about 10 cranks. Let it sink back down to the bottom and just start making the retrieve again. It's a beautiful morning out here. It's actually supposed to be a full eclipse. So we'll, uh, we'll fish through the eclipse. We'll see how that goes today. It should be a lot of fun. <laughs> 